That's nothing to play about. If you want to play, go play sports, go play a game. The family of a teenager killed by gunfire is sharing her story with us this evening. 17 year old Aaliyah Johnson was killed after her boyfriend allegedly showed her his gun and it went off. Chris Hoffman is live with how the family is trying to recover. Chris. Christine, it's the first holiday season without Aaliyah for her family, and right now they are still working through the stages of grief. We had the chance to ca catch up with her great uncle, Sir Diego Brazil, who says his great niece, Aaliyah, was an accomplished student at Gateway High School. She was involved in the McKeesport community by working with the community empowerment program in that area and played softball for the McKees. Port Girls Softball League. She was killed November 20th when, according to police, her boyfriend, 16 year old Emeka Moy King, was showing her his Glock handgun. As he went to put it down, his finger was on the trigger. It went off and she died in his Point Breeze home. Her great uncle says her legacy is being a butterfly in the midst of this challenging world. A rose growing up through the concrete determined, in spite of the challenges around her, in spite of people trying to make her feel less than.